So in this video, we're going to take a HDRI and make it look like this, or even like this. Mm. So to start off with, I downloaded a HDRI from HDRI Haven, or Polyhaven now, I think they've renamed themselves. So go through, find yourself a HDRI. And now jumping over into Blender, I've just put in a car from the Trafficker add-on, and also just put in a asphalt texture from Extreme PBR Combo. You know me. <laughs> so, from here, I've just got a sun lamp. What I'm gonna do is actually delete the sun lamp because I don't want a sun lamp. I want all my lighting to come from a HDRI. So let's jump into shading. And at the moment, I'm straight into the world. So normally it's in object. I'm just gonna straight into world with a background, um, the kind of the gray color. Let's go shift A, search. And I'm gonna add in an image texture. No, I'm not. I'm going to search environment texture. If you put an image texture in, you're gonna stuff yourself. So we'll put that in the background there. We've got the yucky pink color. Let's go to open. Let's find our HDRI that we downloaded. And there it is. And so now we've got that initial HDRI. Looks nice, you know, cool. We've got some really good lighting. However, if we want to improve straight off the bat to make this HDRI look really nice, let's get the color and I'm going to dump it in the strength. And you can see that already the HDRI is just, it's just working so much better. However, we can massage it some more, if you know what I'm saying. So I'm gonna shift A to search, and we'll go into search there. I'm gonna add in a math node, right? And on the math node, I'm gonna throw it in the strength. So now we're kind of going back to what we initially had. So I'm gonna change the add to multiply. So let's kind of like explain this a little bit. Ah, oh, so as well, these here is from the node preview add-on. So all those are linked in the description. Um, so what's actually happening is the math node is black is zero, white is one, okay? So if we're multiplying by 0.5, if we multiply zero by 0.5, we get zero. If we multiply one by 0.5, we get 0.5. So that's why kind of getting darker. So we can do it on the flip side. So if I go value of two, that means we're multiplying the white, which is one by two. So it's twice as bright, where if we're multiplying zero by two, it's still zero, basic maths. And so that's how we can kind of get that effect. So obviously if we go down to 0.1, you know, the lights really come down. And so that's how we can get that, this kind of look. So this is a very short tutorial. If you like this, let me know, leave a comment, like, and subscribe, all that jazz. Good job, Frank.